And uh, I can't really tell you what it's going to be about because I don't really know. I just had a few crazy ideas and decided to put them together. <laughs> hey, that's how I film videos now. Welcome to the first episode of Makeup and Memories. I haven't seen anybody else do this. If they have, I'm sorry. People will be sure to let me know. <laughs> so basically, I'm just gonna do my makeup and um, kind of react to, watch, show you guys all the weird, bizarre, cringy sketches I made as a child. I figure maybe we'll do like one or two memories per episode and then when I run out maybe you guys can send me yours and we can like reminisce about your cringy like 90s early 2000s videos. We all have them, right? So I actually have like my normal everyday makeup on already and I'm gonna take it off for you guys. That's how much I love you. I had to wear a little because I had to go get my plates renewed today which was so fun. I sure hope I'm recording right now. My new camera doesn't communicate with my monitor. So I can see myself on the monitor, but I don't see like the little red dot. I don't see my camera settings at the bottom like I used to, like there's something not working there. So it is awful when my assistant's not here. Gosh, look at the redness. Not cute today, friends. Anyway, when my assistant's not here, it sucks. I'm gonna have to get up like 45 times while filming this and go check to see if I'm recording. So I think after like 18 minutes or something, it stops, but I don't know that it stopped. And then the camera just shuts off and I'm like, <laughs> cool. Grab a drink. Today I have some orange vanilla seltzer. Buckle up. It's gonna get real weird up in here. Okay, we're gonna try this one that I'm most excited about. I don't really know what's on it, but when I was converting it, I just saw that it was me talking to a camera, so I'm very curious right now to see like what exactly I was saying. I'm gonna start with these two products that I've been obsessed with lately. You guys already know this. <sighs> I'm nervous. Okay, here we go. I would just love to inform you. And I just fell down the stairs <laughs> and I urinated my pants. I guess because I was frightened. I wish I could have got it on tape, but I didn't. Okay, right off the bat. <laughs> It's possible I was telling the truth, but I kind of feel like this is a lie. I used to lie so much as a kid, like for laughs or just for, I don't know, attention. I had a rough childhood, okay? So I kind of feel like this, so I kind of feel like this was just an excuse to say that I urinated my pants because I think I kind of remember feeling like the word urinated was funny. Okay, let's move on. It's probably kind of funny, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I can tell this is gonna be a really good video. Good afternoon. And welcome. Oh no. Good afternoon. I'm Jimmy Fritch. We know. I can't tell if I'm genuinely not getting the intro that I want or if I'm faking it, you know what I mean? To come off like I'm, I don't know. I remember this feeling all too well of having only a video camera. I didn't have any way to edit videos and so there was no chance of like just continuing if you mess up, you had to start over. And welcome to the show that I like to call Gerbils in Heels or Best Time Books, I promise. Oh my gosh, get to the point. I'm very interested in these gerbils and heels. Oh, welcome to the show I like to call Gerbils and Heels Bearing Men's Underwear. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> so judging by how I look in this video, I'm gonna peg myself at probably 12. I don't know if my sense of humor was similar to other 12 year olds my age, but that is <laughs> what a bizarre title to a show. Like obviously I was trying to be funny, but still how did my brain even think of that? <laughs> oh my God, that should be my next thing I put on merch. <laughs> All right, moving on. Today's show is going to be a very interesting one, and uh, I can't really tell you what it's going to be about because I don't really know. I just had a few crazy ideas and decided to put them together. <laughs> yeah. Hey, that's how I film videos now. Some things never change. I'd like to bring out some guests I've got today. I've got Molly Shannon, um, Elaine Hendricks, Kristen Dunst, and uh, some past authority figures, a few underground people, you know, so. <laughs> First of all, I know who Molly Shannon is, but who is Elaine Hendricks? I do not remember doing... Wait a minute. Do I remember this, kind of? Hold on, let me Google Elaine Hendricks real quick. Yes, okay. I kinda vaguely remember where this is going. Why did I say past authority figures? They're so, uh, guys, first episode I'm shooting of the show. And you guys are my first guest, so what do you have to say to me? I might just wanna kick your I'm gonna teach you about to walk your Put Jerry Maguire on the phone. <laughs> well, I might just want to kick y'all. Okay. <laughs> this 
this is so stupid, but yet kind of hilarious. This is how you can tell I was absolutely obsessed with movies because somehow in my 12 year old brain, I was able to just recall off the top of my head three different movies where the characters all yell the same thing about kicking someone's butt. <laughs> and I'm actually living for this right now because I <laughs> still love doing this. I do this now where I interact with like a movie scene. Now it's more sophisticated. I have a green screen and everything, but how funny that I was d trying to do this even back then. If you guys watch your old tapes, like do you, do you just find out that you're still the exact same person, just slightly more mature? Okay, looks like we're not gonna be uh, needing any more help from those guests. All right, yeah, y'all can leave. I've got a new thing on the show. I need all you dozens of viewers out there just Hit me up and, uh, <laughs> I still say that. I still say all you dozens of viewers. Where did I get that? Dozens of viewers out there. Just hit me up at uh, idiotloser.com and tell me how you like this, all right? Okay, we obviously have to see if idiotloser.com is a website. This is a placeholder for your new website. <laughs> Maybe I should buy this domain name. This could literally be like my new website. Instead of jamiefrench.com, we'll just do this. Oh, uh, guys, I gotta pause really quick to tell you something. ColourPop just released their Wild Nothing collection. It is their best collection yet, I promise you. I'm not a big collection person, but oh my gosh, this is phenomenal. I've been insanely obsessed with this blush, so in the shade Wayfarer. So here we go. <gasps> How did that start looking so bad overnight? I got this new idea for the show, it's called the animal section and it's going to show you a little bit about nature how animals react reacted when they saw me for the first time <laughs> that makes perfect sense full blown self-deprecating humor even as a literal child oh shoot am i allowed to show this since i was a literal child in this video like does it count since i'm an adult now <sighs> guess we'll find out using makeup geek today and pretty much every day <laughs> i thought i was done a second ago but i wasn't done i also showed my actual real fish's reaction my dog's reaction, I guess she was so bored she fell asleep. By the way, that dog's name was Gracie and she was the best dog ever. She would <laughs> she would always go in the living room and go over to the window and like put her head under the curtain and just sit there with the curtain on her head just looking around all day. And what's with the weird just freeze frame on my face? That was another thing I would do all the time was freeze frames is what I called them. Where I would just like insert some real weird for oh. one second. <laughs> I'm a weird person. Well, you can obviously tell those animals like me a lot. <clears throat> I don't think this show's going well, so. <laughs> I don't think this show's going well, so insert weird ugly face and fish eye. By the way, that fish's name was Bobita. I named it. My mom was like obsessed with this fish tank and she would call all the fish her fish friends and every night she would come downstairs. <laughs> like to feed them and she would go, fish friends unite. <laughs> or some nights if she wanted to switch it up, she'd say, fish friends congregate. And she wanted to name that fish Pinky Tuscadero, but I was like, no, its name is Bobita. Sorry, mom. There you are, Molly, come on over here. So Molly, um, I heard that you uh like lighting on fire. Is that, is that true? <laughs> this is truly the best show I've ever seen. Why is that so funny? Why is interacting with the movie so funny? Hey, well, uh, let's move on. What, a, what are you doing with your hands? Sometimes when I get nervous, I stick my fingers under my arms and then I smell like that. Okay, well. Okay. <laughs> Look at those teeth, man. Yikes. I used to have a name for my teeth and I called them the Jumblies. Oh my god, I have them. I have a mold of the Jumblies. I just got it when I was helping my mom move. Hold on. Here they are. <laughs> Can you tell? Can you tell her I see? October 21st, 2002. So I guess I was actually 13 because this video was filmed after this because I can see in the video that I have braces. So I was wrong. I was 13. Okay, whatever. All right, let's keep going. See what else we got. There's only 33 seconds left in this particular one. Um, I think... We should stop because this show ain't working out like I said before. <laughs> okay, so. Oh, 
well, I guess at least I was self-aware enough to know that it was time to hang it up. You know, my career as a talk show host just wasn't gonna pan out. You know who I really wish could see this? Elaine Hendricks. <laughs> By the way, if you guys don't recognize the movie footage that I'm using, most of the clips are from the movie Superstar, which I was obsessed with. Obviously starring Molly Shannon, who I was also obsessed with. Any female comedian was like, my favorite person in the world. All right, we're gonna move on to our next video, but before we do that, I wanna let you know what I'm using. This is a Jelly Mud shadow from the same color pop collection, the Wild Nothing collection, and this is in the color Mojave Moves. It is gorgeous. Oh, maybe I could apply it with my nail. <laughs> oh gosh! Now see, that worked out just fine. What is going on here? Let's find one with my sister in it. All right, now we're gonna travel back even further in my childhood to where I am probably about three, maybe two. My sister and I are putting on a show in my grandparents' basement. <laughs> Literally my favorite pastime ever. Let's just see what happens. It's far, far away behind the moon. Beyond the Rain. Oh, my sister's reciting Wizard of Oz. It was like her f literal favorite movie of all time. And I guess I'm just pouting. Well, over the rainbow. <gasps> Why did I make that line so thick? I have literally never done that in my life. Because of the wonderful things she does over Jamie. Jamie, we can't see when you close it. We don't open. see the wizard. No! Okay, first of all, that was the like world's saddest cry ever. <laughs> Second of all, why are kids so weird? Like, why did I need the closet door closed halfway? <laughs> I love hearing my grandma's voice. I miss her so much, and she's just so sweet. She's like, Jamie, we can't see you if you close it. I would have been like, leave the closet door open. The wonderful <laughs> You know what I also love? <laughs> I start bawling. And my sister's just like, oh, is he the wonderful ah! Sibling love. Yay. Good job, Jenna. Will you stand right there a minute, Jamie? All right, Jed, will you give me just a minute? For <laughs> Sorry, Gramps, no can do. Oh, I don't want to go sing with my sister. I'd rather hold this picture block. You want to go sing with Jenna? Oh, that was it. Oh, children. Come on, I'm wasting what? film. Let's go here. <laughs> it kills me hearing my grandpa say he's wasting film because did you guys see the video I just put up like a couple months ago of him talking to a hawk in his front yard? He says the same exact thing to the hawk. <laughs> I'm running out of film. I'm also running out of patience. I'm bored. 28 years later. <laughs> Where are you and your baby going? We got a deal, uh, Oh, your baby? What happened? Okay, what's with the fire and throwing babies? Like, I swear I'm not a violent person. <laughs> you sure that wasn't on purpose? Seems to me you threw your baby down. <laughs> oh, Grandpa. Well, you know what? That's enough video for today. What conclusion can I draw from today's home videos? Well, one thing I've learned for sure today is that people really don't change. <laughs> and the other conclusion I've drawn is that I need some new jokes and some new material. Definitely not a good sign when you're still using the same jokes you used at 13. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. As always, let me know if you like this type of video or if I should never do it again. I will, of course, value your opinion. And tune in next week where we watch me and my friends episode of Extreme Makeover. Bye. How come this eye's on fleek and this one is... Oh! Oh, girl, go back to your home, would ya? Anybody got a bobby pin? Bye! I tell you why. I would sit. I so long. My head all full of stuffing. My heart all full of pain. Do -do 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 -do. I would sit and be merry. Life would be a ding. Thank you.